what's up guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here of course thanks for watching i'm gonna need you to go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos but yeah in today's video we're going to be doing a closet tour so a few weeks back i did a closet clean out like selling all my shoes video where i just did like a big clean out of my closet and in that video i showed some clips of my closet but i wasn't like ready to show the whole thing because there was still some things that i wanted to like change around and just make different so i decided to film this video because now i've done everything i wanted to do in my closet it's pretty much how i want it and i wanted to show you guys and just do a more in-depth tour and let you know where i got everything from and just also show you how to how you can maximize like a small space if you have a smaller closet like mine so yeah if that's something that you're interested in please keep on watching like i said before don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos i have a updated room tour coming up and i'm also going to be like refreshing and like renewing my bathroom but that one i'm gonna do like a little twist to it because i'm gonna do it on like an extreme budget so i'm just gonna see if i can get a different look in my bathroom with like a very small budget so anyway i feel like that would be interesting um but yeah hit the subscribe button because you don't want to miss any of those videos and we're gonna go ahead and get so into we're gonna it start at the doorway when you first walk in the closet there is clothes all along the left side and to the front and everything but first we're gonna go along the top i'm gonna show you what's up here and let you know where everything came from so starting right here these are three wig hats that i made if you see my very first video then you know um about these i've mentioned in that video that i made some wig hats um, just to wear in between like sew-ins and braids and stuff like when I'm just wearing my regular hair but I want like extensions in and it's something like really quick you know you just put it on so yeah I made three of those I have them sitting up here they're sitting on each of them are on like a wig head and then they're also sitting up on these boxes that I got from Michael's um i actually do use those boxes for storage too there's like pictures and cards and stuff in those so yeah that's what i have in those and that's what the um wig heads are sitting on so after that is where i keep my gucci purses i just have them like i just made a little display with them i have them sitting up on the boxes that they came in just something that i thought was cute to kind of like display them in my closet and the same thing with these purses I just did like a little display of them. I have them sitting up on the boxes that they came in and you know, like some of the boxes behind and everything. So yeah, just something that I thought was cute. Now on this side of the closet, on this wall, I have all of my hats hanging up. <laughs> um, they're hung up like with those thumbtacks. So yeah, I hung them up all around this mirror. I tried to do it kind of like color coordinating so these are like all the black ones then all the gray then like the tan looking colors all the way you know blue and then white so yeah i have those up there and then i even have like two headbands right there on the wall um i purchased those because they were like really popular i thought they would be really cute but once i got them i don't really wear them that much actually i think i i think i've only worn one of them one time but yeah, so that's what's on this wall. And like I said, all of the hats are hung around this mirror right here. I got this mirror from Ross a, long, a while ago, like a long while ago, but I thought it was so cute. It reminds me of like, um, like a Cinderella mirror. I don't know, some type of Disney mirror, basically. That's what it reminded me of back then. So yeah, I thought it was really cute. And that is hung above this black vanity. The black vanity I got from Ross also. On top of the vanity are these jewelry boxes. It's two of them and then one in the middle. And these two, the two on the end, I do have a few jewelry pieces, but not many. I used to have like way more jewelry than I do now, but I noticed I wasn't wearing it, so I got rid of it. So it's just a few pieces in those. Then on top of this one is just some um, filming stuff that I use sometimes. On this one is um, 
like I use this I stick it different places like if I'm filming something in here I might stick it on the mirror or if I'm filming something in the bathroom I might stick it on the mirror so yeah I just have that sitting in here and it's on top of this dre box it's not dre inside this box it is those like sticky bras you know the ones that are supposed to like lift you up when you're not wearing a regular bra I don't know those don't really work that well for me but yeah that's what's inside of there and then in this jewelry box like I said it was like a few more pieces and on top of that is this juicy couture box I have some um items in here I can't really remember what's in here actually but I have something in there because I use all of my little boxes and stuff for storage and then in these three boxes are watches just some Betsy Johnson watches that I've had for a long time that I don't wear anymore. And on top of that is like this little picture thing. This is actually super old. This is um, like a gift card holder. Like if you're getting a gift card from Forever 21 and you put it inside of there. And my mom got me that like so long ago. But I've always liked that picture. And you could tell by the, you could just tell it's super old. But yeah, I just kept it all of this time because I just always like that little picture. So in the middle is another jewelry thing it's like a dress form but it's actually also like a jewelry stand so you're supposed to be able to like hook earrings in here and like hang necklaces and stuff on the hooks but that's another thing where i had a bunch of jewelry on there at one time wasn't wearing it so got rid of pretty much all of it so right now i just have like my scrunchies and my hair ties hanging on it and a few other like i guess these are like i don't know this is a hair thing. I don't know. A few other chains. Oh, those are some ankle bracelets back there. And this little rose that somebody got me. But yeah, so that's what's on top of there. Now, the vanity has a drawer. Inside the drawer is just some um, extra purse straps and Apple Watch boxes. And also, like, the papers that I used in that video when i was saying when i was showing how to make your own graphic tees if you haven't seen that video go ahead and watch that one that was a really cool video so yeah that's what's in there then underneath i just have like all of my um more like luxury style like shopping bags that i didn't want to get rid of so i have several of them under there but um i just have this louis vuitton one in the front then next to that is where I put my ring light that I use for filming. I store it in here. Oh yeah, just I store it in here. I just have it standing next to these rain boots. These are some Marc Jacobs rain boots that I like hardly ever wear, but I didn't want to get rid of them. So yeah, I have them standing next to that. Then on this side, I have some Ugg boots. I have those right there because I always throw those on like just when I need to put something on my feet real quick. So this closet has like this little opening area. And in this area, I have all of my shoe boxes just stacked up all the way down to the ground and it goes like all the way up. And this is just where I store my shoes, how I store them for now. Um, I've been saying that I wanted to like put them all in like clear boxes or something but I don't know if I'm ever gonna do that I might but right now this is how I have them and in between I don't like to get rid of anything <laughs> so in between these boxes are like other like shopping bags but I do actually reuse these type of bags a lot like if I'm getting rid of clothes I'm giving somebody something I just put it in here and give it to them or oh, yeah, like, and, like plastic ones from Shein with like the zipper closure I use those a lot like when I'm traveling you know like for packing you could put like like if you like if you're the type of person like me who likes to like separate your outfits and everything you can like separate them and put them inside of there and then just put it in your suitcase like put the whole outfit in there and just make things like easier and more organized so yeah i have like extra shopping bags in between the shoe boxes okay so, so now on the back of my door i have this hanging shoe organizer i got that from walmart and in here i just have mostly all of my slides just hung up you know it was just an easy way to organize them and display them and make it easy when i just need to grab a pair real quick to put on 
so yeah that's on the back of my door and like i said this closet isn't super big so i had to think of like different storage so solutions so now with the clothes so starting right here i have this this is supposed to be another jewelry thing it's a hanging jewelry organizer like i said i used to have so much jewelry so right now it's pretty empty it's all empty in the back all of that used to be full so the only thing i have in there right now are my waist beads that i wear sometimes well i wear them often actually um so i have those stored in there and that's literally like the only thing that's hanging in there right now so yeah next is this bag hanging on this um belt hanger i got this from free people and basically i have this at the beginning of my closet and i use this to store items that i've already worn that i don't want anymore i either like sell them or give them away just so i don't keep it in my closet so like once i have done my laundry and i'm putting things up if it's if it's something that i know like okay i'm only gonna wear that one time i don't want this anymore you know i just put it in here so then I'll know I need to get rid of that. Okay, right after the bag at the beginning, I have all of my extra hangers. I try to use the same hangers in my closet. Um, I try to use these for like my pants and my shirts. These I use for like heavier items or things that may like slip off of a hanger. And um, jackets I use these kind for. So I try to use all black hangers and just you know use them for different items and then after that i have like all of my clothes hung up at the beginning i usually hang all of my new stuff like stuff i haven't worn yet i usually always hang that in the front so if you recognize these these are all from my um pretty little thing haul so i have them hung up right there if you haven't seen that video go and watch that haul it was some really cute pieces in there so yeah, my newer clothes, I hang them right there because I don't have like a rolling rack yet. I kind of want to get one because I feel like I feel like I could get a rolling rack, put my new stuff on it and like roll it like right here because it's not like I just walk all in my closet all the time. And then like when I need to get in, I feel like I could just pull the rack out into my room because I have plenty of space, you know, and get what I need, whatever. But I don't know. I'm still debating on that. So right now I hang all of my new stuff at the beginning. And then after that, I try to um, pretty much color coordinate my clothes. Except for right here, I don't have it um, by color because I put all my flannels right here. It's missing one because I'm wearing it right now. So that's what this hanger is from. So yeah, so yeah um, okay, I already mentioned the flannels. So then it starts out with like cream. So I have like creams and whites. You know those type of shirts this shirt looks kind of it was like a tan shirt then it goes to like gray so it has like a lot of my gray tops then it goes to black so then it has like black and i even have them um i have most of them like separated by like long sleeve and stuff like within that color section so then it goes like green all the green tops then like tans, blues, then like red colors. And then after that, I have dresses and like jumpsuits or like two piece, like the pants and the top type outfits. Then after that, I have jackets. So I have like all of my denim jackets first. Then like my, what are these? Like military print or army print jackets. Then I have like, what do I call these? Like more athletic style jackets. Like that. Then I have like all hoodies. And if you remember, I recently did like a really big closet clean out. I have a video on that. Also, if you haven't seen that, go and watch it. I gave like a little preview or whatever of my closet but i just wanted to do this more in-depth closet tour but that's why a lot of stuff like i don't know i just really wanted to get rid of like a lot of clothes and kind of like start over because my style is a little different now and like just evolving so i got rid of a whole bunch of stuff 
but anyway so yeah this is like all the hoodies that's what this section is supposed to be and it's also still supposed to be by color like i said and then this is all like my bigger jackets you'll probably remember these from the pretty little thing haul the big puffer jackets and then like this big like fluffy jacket like another fluffy one another like puffer one another fluffy yeah and then all back there is like more military style jackets like this one and also my longer jackets like the um are they trench like trench coat style jackets i guess that's what i want to call them and then also like bomber jackets just all different styles of jackets and it goes all the way back and then right here i have my jeans so now i purchased this like you see how it's like double like some of the jeans are up here and some of them are down there so i purchased this like raw doubling thing from walmart and all you do is basically just like that right there and then a bar that goes across and another one and they just hang in your closet like it was a hanger so you just hang that up there then so I have my first row like on the actual hanging thing that's a part of my closet so I have like my jeans are color coordinated too so this is like the white this is like tan type stuff green gray and then this is supposed to be all like light blue jeans then it goes to like medium blue and that goes all the way down there oh there's more green okay so this green was up here because it's like a different material but anyway so there's green pants then it goes to like medium blue and then all the way to dark blue from dark blue all the way to black so that's how I have that coordinated and like I said I got that hanging bar thing from Walmart and I just think it made it look way better <laughs> and it gave me more space that was a way see that's the thing like when you have a smaller closet like me you have to figure out ways to like you know like be organized and like just make the best use of your space so that's a really good idea if you have a smaller closet is to get something like that and also like I said like to use the different boxes and stuff and use those to store things too okay so now down at the bottom so at the bottom on the top of these clear containers are more shoes and it goes all the way to the end it's more more shoes all under there those are shoes that so yeah it's more shoes all under there those are all shoes that i didn't have the boxes for anymore and i needed a place to put them so i put them on top of these so i have um five of these clear containers i have five of them but yeah so they don't look so organized looking at them from the front but they they really are um some of the stuff probably just needed to be folded better i mean i pretty much tried to fold everything but it's kind of like squished in there bras and like darker color bras and this one i have all of my black underwear and this one i have all of my like nude colored underwear and like lighter colors and then also like the nude color bras and lighter colors right there i have like sports bras and this is like <laughs> stuff to capacity because i have so many sports bras but i tried to fit them all in there and i tried to do them by like brands so i'll try to i can't open it all the way but i have it basically like victoria's secret right here nike in the middle and then pink over there but it's like super stuff to capacity then in this one i have mostly all of my workout clothes like pretty much everything that i could fit in there and these two i have more sports bras and more workout clothes but i couldn't fit everything in here so i have like storage um organizers under my bed where i put them in this drawer i have like all of my socks like nike socks um like gucci socks uh pink you know just a whole bunch of socks like way more socks than anyone ever needs i have so many socks it doesn't make any sense okay so in these three i have body suits so in this one i have all of my black body suits and this one i have like my lighter colors and my nudes and like my skin tone color body suits and in this one i have like all different colors like ones that are multicolored or like blue or green 
like that okay and this drawer section i have biker shorts up here and this is like the black and the gray actually they look kind of mixed up now that i'm looking at it but this is supposed to be like black and what color this is supposed to be like black and i think like tan or like nude or something and then this one is supposed to be like browns and like grays so yeah those two drawers are body suits this drawer is crop tops which i have a bunch of those too so yeah that's like all like different sorts of crop tops and stuff this drawer is my night clothes this one is swimsuits and this one is more socks i told y'all i have way too many socks i don't know what's with me in socks now towards this end this corner of the closet i have more purses because if you remember i have a lot of purses up here at the top but that's all of my designer purses that i wanted to like display but of course i have like regular purses too even though i hardly wear them but i have all of my cute little like regular purses so you know and they're like all under there you can't <laughs> you cannot see them it's like those long jackets that are hung up they're like on top of them and stuff but it's a whole bunch of them back there and then in here i have more purses that couldn't fit right here and i also have like book bags and like tote bags and just all sorts of other bags and purses in there and in this storage container I so in this first one I have like all my shorts and skirts in there in this next one I have like um, a bunch of like two-piece sets and shirts like things that I just didn't feel the need to hang up like long sleeve crop tops and like a bunch of athletic shirts like nike shirts and all of that i put like basically all the shirts and little sets that i didn't need to hang up i put them in there so i believe that i've shown you everything so yeah mostly in these because i don't have a dresser so like in these things right there and the ones along the wall is like stuff that maybe typically would go in a dresser but i don't have a dresser so i just tried to think of other storage solutions that would work with my closet and i don't believe i mentioned where i got them from all of these clear storage containers came from walmart this big clear one came from walmart these black boxes i believe those came from ross also so yeah that is everything in my closet that is your full in-depth closet review i believe i went over everything i showed you everything told you where everything was from um i think i mentioned my hangers all of the hangers like i said the ones that the pants are hung on and these these all came from walmart the soft ones came from ross in case i didn't mention that but yeah i think that is everything i really hope that you guys enjoyed this video please don't forget to like this video go ahead and hit the subscribe button right now before you leave so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos so yeah that's everything i really hope you enjoyed it and as always thank you so much for watching bye